Hey, how you doing? So another short one today on my Harvey T40 lathe. It comes with a four tooth drive spur uh, that Morse taper two mounts in the headstock and you knock it out with a knockout bar. So you have it very tight from turning your, your piece. There's a knockout bar, slide hammer knockout bar. You put it through from this end all the way through and knock it out. Well, when it's tight, that means you're hammering on the bearings. Not, not my favorite thing, uh, partially because my old lathe didn't have a way to use a knockout bar. So what I did was I made a safety nut for it. So this nut starts as a part from Grizzly. That's big part from Grizzly and it's designed to adapt one of their uh, chucks. So it's got three holes, and all I did was grind the, <laughs> grind the whole nut down because I'm not a machinist. I ground it down so it would fit. I went and bought a big washer and made sure that the drive center would fit all the way through and mounted it. So pretty straightforward. You put it on the lathe before you start, Mount your drive center. Uh, I'm not a fan of the 4.1. I like the multi one, and these are really cheap on Amazon. Um, it seems to work better for me. Mount it on there, turn your piece, and then when you need to take it off, you use the other supplied tool in here, and you know, trusty adjustable wrench to take it loose. And when the washer hits the backside of the drive spur, it pushes the drive spur out easily. This, it might make no difference at all, but it feels smart, you know? It's one of those logical things that feels safer uh, to me than banging on the bearings, and that st sitting on there will protect the threads when I'm not using it. Or gluing things up or things, other things that I do on the lathe. Uh, that's the short one today. Talk to you soon, good luck.